so look at this one here now. Let, let me finish off this also. I'll make it big. Mm, yeah, try to see this. Uh, th this is called like a axilla. Sorry, th this uh, wrong words. You can convert this into plane diagram and try to work out here. So in the plane diagram, how do it appear? I'll make it a little bit small because I need space. Okay, no, go, go for plane diagram, the plane diagram. So first the, the red color stream. Uh, where, where the where the axle axle <coughs> this axle the shaft will be here no mm, yeah this will be mm, now I think so it is then so blue color string should come from here no m2 this is it no no let's analyze all so here the tension t1 t1 by 2 t1 by 2 here only tension t2 so therefore total tension will be t1 this is that Axis O. Sir, how are tensions equal, sir? T1, T1 by T. They, they will be equal. Is it the same string, sir? Ah, sir. I'll, I'll, I'll mount it a number of turns on this side and this side will be equal. And exactly at the midpoint what happened, that this distance will be the exactly this, this point of suspension of this and this. Means this distance will become equal to this. The tension will become equal. The different strings. How same string it will be? <coughs> okay. There, therefore, this is a tension T one. The weight m one g will act here. The weight m two g. Now you take T2. Now tell me what will happen to this. This will move down. What will happen to this <coughs> shaft axle system? It will only rotate or it will also translate down. It will also translate down. It will have rotation alpha 1 and also it will accelerate down. Uh, why it should move down? I think it is not suspended. No, the string is wound. So what I do? I'll take a string. I'll I'll wound it. Then another string, blue color string, is wound on the shaft, and a block is suspended. So th this is what happens here. So let's take this particular point. Oh, yeah, now there's a point P two. There's a point P one. Let's write all the possible equations <coughs> first. T2 
M2G, acceleration of the block. And then what about the torque? It will rotate about O only. It will rotate about O. So I'll, I'll do one thing, I'll write alpha naught. So T1 into R1 plus T2 into R2. The radius R, radius R1, R2. Both will set up clockwise torque, no? Should be equal to I O alpha naught. Moment of inertia of this, let it be I naught. You cannot write that of cylinder. M I of Now what is axis? This axis. Huh? Axis will pass through point two. Hmm. Then uh, this is about so what about the translative motion? <coughs> yes, it will also describe translative motion. M1 G plus T2 minus T1 equal to M1 A1. How many unknowns are there? Many, you know. So let me go for the red color string. Aggregation of point P1 along y axis must be zero. Any reason for that? Because the string is inextensible. So from that, A P1 y should be zero. So from this, what is the equation you can write it is? A1 minus R1 alpha naught should be equal to zero. Solving this will get relation between A1 and R alpha. Similarly, aggregation of point P2 should be equal to aggregation of the block. Because string must be inextensible. What is the aggregation of point P2? Should be A1 plus R2 alpha naught. I naught, I naught, that's all. I naught. Total moment of finish is I naught, that's all over. So look at the constraint equation from where we have brought it. Ah, both, both. I think chapati, chapati roller, chapati roller. I think both, both parts of the chapati roller. When you roll it, both parts will rotate. No, don't think again. Shaft and the axle will have different. The thicker one is called a shaft, and the so like a, the, the one which is uh, so like a thick is called a shaft, and one is thin, is called a axle. That's all. They are connected. It's like I think you can see this part of the diagram here. It's not that this will rotate separately, this will rotate separately. It's not that it's a, so what is the diagram? The diagram is like this. Huh? Uh, where do you see lathe machine? Uh, nowadays, I think you can see carpenter shop, wood cutting there. You, you do one thing, just make observation. Nowadays, uh, if you get a time, go there, just make observation. You, you do all get machines will come there. Wear mask, go take center. Don't get into shop. Stand outside and make observation. Outside world is full of scientific. Huh? No need to research lab. Many say India research labs are not there. All shops are research lab. Huh? The total world is research lab. If you are interested, you will observe. Sir, I will go for Indian Institute of Science to do research. Why? Outside world is not there. It is a wrong concept. Huh? We are just searching reason to escape from thinking. <laughs> Outside world is a research lab, but the total world is a research lab. Kitchen is a research lab. Everything, all objects are res like a research things only, if you start thinking. Hmm? So I think I gave enough uh, diagrams, everything shown. So today what happened, you try to see them. One or two objects, you try to, Chapati Belan is there like this, try to work out, N nothing wrong. Sir, where to get string? I think cotton thread, spool, for sewing machines, we use no purchase in one inch shop, you'll get around for 10 rupees. That is enough. Sir, uh, what about blocks? Some eraser. Finish over. Block M2 is eraser. Manage. Okay, I'll wind up the class. Tomorrow we'll continue further some other different types of numericals. Huh? Okay, thank you all of you. Okay, thank you all of you. Take care. Bye. See you. Thank you. Thank you. Sir. Thank you sir.